Hello, Med Security. This is Ben Hallback with Hub International. We are the broker for the benefits that we are going to go over today. And speaking of today, we have our 2024 2025 enrollment options uh, that I'm going to walk through medical, dental, and vision, couple of uh, just administrative items. These bullet points indicate uh, what I call uh, qualified life events. And it's not just me, the IRS calls them qualified life events as well. So what you pick during open enrollment sticks for one year and can't be changed unless you have one of these qualifying events going on during the middle of the year, marriage, divorce, birth of a baby, spouses, open enrollments, uh, things like that. So just make sure that you are uh, making the best decision possible during open enrollment when you can make, uh, you can put somebody on the plan, take somebody off. We are staying with United Healthcare. The policy number is the same. The plans are the same as they were last year. The least expensive option is on the left-hand side. That is good catastrophic coverage. Everything tracks towards this $5,000 individual maximum. That's for 12 months in a 6350 out of pocket worst case scenario. So you meet your deductible first, you share in cost after the deductible. Once you hit 6350 from January to December, it resets every January. That's not new, just a reminder. Uh, but once you hit that 6350 per belly button number, insurance covers the rest uh, for qualified services. There's also a buyout plan. This plan has co-pays or just flat rates. That was tough to say, flat rates before the deductible. So co-pays, just a flat rate for doctors and for prescription drugs here, a little lower deductible and a little lower out-of-pocket maximum or worst case scenario. So those are the main features that you're going to use throughout the year. They did not change from last year. Lindsay will have all of the pricing uh, for any of these uh, plans that you would like to look at. So obviously her contact information is there. So make sure that you reach out if you have a question. Last uh, couple of things on the medical side. If you are on our plan with UHC, go ahead and register. You can download that QR code. They have an app. Uh, it's myuhc.com is their website right here. Uh, you can look for in-network doctors, see where you are on your deductible, get ID cards, all of that good stuff. Uh, this is a slide for um, virtual visits, so you can access your virtual visit through uhc.com uh, as well. And this slide is a reminder, unless it is life or limb threatening, please stay out of the emergency room. If it is life or limb threatening, then go directly to the emergency room, whether it's inside of a hospital, like what's down here, or a freestanding ER. Other than that, you can get a lot of what you need, hack, cold, sneeze. Like, for example, today I'm kind of nasally. Um, I've got something going around. And so I my best option would either be virtual care or a dock in a box like an urgent care provider. Dental is the same as it was last year. We did not make changes. The carrier is still Humana. The policy number is the same and it works the same. You get $1,000 per year per mouth. Once you hit that, then you're sharing in cost after they spot you $1,000 for covered services. So an example of that would be your preventive services, $0. You go in, but then you've got a cavity and it's 20% uh, after your deductible. Let's say the cavity, cavity it's $200. 200 minus 50 is 150. You're paying 20% of that uh, uh, $150 bill. So you're paying $30. The insurance company is paying 120. 30 plus 120 is 150. And that 130 that they just paid posts against or reduces your $1,000 per year. Now, once they do pay out $1,000 for covered services, um, the cool feature is that you're splitting 70, 30 uh, on uh, the rest of covered services. So there is still protection there in an insurance payment uh, after they pay out that thousand dollars. If you get ortho, you get it one time. Thousand um, dollars is better than nothing. I've got a couple of kids in ortho. So boy, I know those bills. Uh, and uh, just make sure you're enrolled in the plan for uh, 
one year before you exercise that ortho benefit. Costs uh, are here and those are listed out. Uh, let's see, Humana is still our vision carrier. These glasses, uh, I could have gone uh, to the IMED Insight Network. I go in for 10 bucks and then I've got a decision to make. Do I want lenses and frames or do I want contacts? So they'll give me 130 bucks for contacts or they'll give me 130 bucks. <laughs> and then if there's money over that, then they take 20% off. Here's the kicker. Like these glasses, I have to shrink these things down just to fit on my face. I'm not paying a 10, uh, excuse me, $15 copay. That's pretty normal. So it really depends on your eyesight in terms of if you can get out for a copay for the lenses. If you're blind uh, like me, then you might have to pay some additional just to shrink them down. Costs are here. And then we've got a free stuff page, confidential counseling, three counseling services per year. So why wouldn't you want to give this as a present to anybody you know? Here's some free counseling and you cost me three sessions. But luckily, it's through UHC. Uh, Med Security already covers this and it's already baked in. Premium only plan just means any uh, employer benefit that can go from employer to employee without tax we will do so. Uh, screenshot on EAP and the rest of this, y'all, is great late night reading material. There are required notices that we put in for um, adherence to all the different compliance things that are necessary. If you have any questions, reach out to Lindsay or reach out to us on anything uh, that I'm scrolling through. You might be getting a little seasick at the moment because there's a lot of um, compliance related items for uh, these benefits. If you have any questions throughout the year, uh, my name is Ben. Uh, I work just right downtown. Please feel free to give me a call or ask me any questions that you might have. Sachi is also on my team. And uh, you also have Lindsay throughout the year. So we want to make sure that you get answers to questions that you have in a timely fashion. And with that being said, thanks for hanging on and uh, enjoy your benefits for uh, the year. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to let us know. Have a great day. Bye-bye.